Normally, I make videos about marketing and advertising to help promote your business, but today I'm going off the beaten path a bit because I want to cover an interesting topic that I've been wanting to do for a while, and that is how big is a billion? More specifically, how big is a billion dollars? We see the number billion in the news all the time. Taylor Swift's heiress tour grossing a billion dollars. According to Forbes magazine, Detroit Lions are worth $3.6 billion. According to Wikipedia, Warren Buffett has a net worth of $119 billion. And for me, as well as I think a lot of people, it's hard to wrap our heads around how big these numbers actually are. So let me offer the following example to try and put a billion dollars into perspective. Let's say I gave you $10,000 cash. That would be $100, $100 bills. And even with inflation for the average person, $10,000 is still a pretty good day at the office. Now, let's say I gave you this $10,000 wad of cash every single day. So Monday, you have $10,000. Tuesday, you have $20,000. And by the end of the week, you have $70,000. So my question to you is this. If we continue at this pace of me giving you $10,000 a day, every single day, how many days would it take to reach a million dollars? Answer, 100 days, which is just a little over three months. So congratulations, you're now a millionaire. So let's keep this going. If I'm still giving you $10,000 a day, every single day, how long would it take for you to reach a billion dollars? The difference between a million and a billion is just three zeros, right? At the rate of $10,000 a day, every single day, to get to a billion dollars, it'll take approximately 274 years. That's nearly three centuries. That is insane. Okay, so now let's say you have a billion dollars in your possession. What could you do with that amount of money? Well, if you did nothing and just parked it in a savings account at your bank, and yes, I know you can't just go down to your local bank and deposit a billion dollars. We're just talking hypotheticals here. But if you were only collecting a measly 3% annual interest on your $1 billion, you'd collect $30 million a year in interest. Let's look at this in terms of homes. In most places, you can get a pretty nice house for about $500,000. With a billion dollars, you could buy 2,000 of these half million dollar homes and give them out as Christmas gifts or whatever you want. Or you could do like Mr. Beast does and help those less fortunate, whether it be providing food, housing, clean drinking water, or whatever social cause you're passionate about to make the world a better place. And you'd still have plenty left for your garage full of expensive cars. Anyway, that's how big a billion is. So the next time you see a corporation reporting a $20 billion profit or the government wanting to invest $50 billion into some project, instead of looking at those figures like monopoly money, hopefully you now have a better feel for how big those numbers actually are. So that's it for now. This is Mark Brinker. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. Have a great day and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.